George Kelly, his real name is George Komsky, was a singer act from season 1 of America's Got Talent. He was eliminated in the semifinals. Background George Komsky grew up in Northern California. He started vocal training at an early age when his grandfather Leo encouraged him to study with a local cantor. Elvis's Love Me Tender was the first song he ever learned. In 2001, he traveled to Italy to perform Verdi's Requiem at Street. Hall's Basilica in Rome under the leadership of Bay Area choir director Bruce Kaliha and William Hall conducting. Under the tutelage of Professor Emeritus Dewey Camp he secured a place in UCLA's esteemed opera program. Not having a place to practice at night, while living in the dorms, he practiced in the UCLA parking garages. While in school he met and was instructed by David Romano, the celebrated tenor from Broadway's The Phantom of the Opera, and vocal maestro for Sarah Brightman and Josh Groban. His tutelage helped him become a soloist for the internationally acclaimed Irish phenomenon Riverdance. When George returned home he caught the attention of a talent scout while singing at Caff Roma in Los Angeles, and later auditioned for America's Got Talent. One audition George Cully's audition in episode 101 was never televised, but he revealed in an interview that he sang Caruso. It is unknown whether or not he was Buzz, but at least two judges voted yes, sending George to the semifinals. Semifinals George Cully's week 4 semifinals performance in episode 110 consisted of singing You Raise Me Up. Piers Morgan, Brandy Norwood, and David Hasselhoff all gave George votes. George did not receive enough votes to finish in at least second place in America's vote, eliminating him from the competition in episode 111, instead of Celtic Spring and David and Danny Quick Change. After the show after graduating from UCLA, Komsky starred in Dublin Worldwide Productions The Twelve Irish Tenors, and once again went on tour. An ill-fated accident in 2009 led to his being hospitalized for a collapse of his right lung, threatening his ability to sing. Six months of recovery, and near constant vocal therapy with vocal coach Seth Riggs helped him to get back on his feet. He has since successfully sold out San Francisco's famous Herbs Theater twice, and was featured on the San Francisco CBS Evening News in a special segment on October 23, 2011. Presently, George is a featured guest soloist on Grammy Award-winning trumpeter Chris Body's worldwide tour, with recent concert engagements at Carnegie Hall, the Kennedy Center, San Francisco Symphony, Vancouver Symphony Orchestra, Nashville Symphony, Buffalo Philharmonic Orchestra Oregon Symphony, Houston Symphony Colorado Symphony, and Indianapolis Symphony. He was also honored to be a part of Mr. Body's 10th consecutive annual residency at the Blue Note Jazz Club in New York City for 42 shows. George donates his time to various charities, among them Face Forward, The Fallen Heroes, The Wheelchair Foundation, Anti-Defamation League, IDF, and Act Today for Autism Care and Treatment in Los Angeles, where he recently headlined in law fundraiser with Grammy Award winner Brian McKnight. Komsky opened the 2014 APAC Policy Conference in Washington, D.C. in front of a 14,000-person delegation. George has performed the national anthem for the New England Patriots and Oakland Raiders, as well as the San Francisco Giants. He lives in Los Angeles and loves long walks, football, movie reviews, and dark chocolate. George returned to season 7, as a vocal duo with Bradley Whist. The act was not televised, but they made it past the auditions, but did not compete in the Vegas round. Thank you for watching the video. If you like it, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.